Welcome to Star C Direct. If this is your first time visiting my channel, welcome to The Edge, baby. I would like to welcome all new galactic visitors as well as my A1 Day Ones. Thank you so much for your continual support. I am a Star Seed mompreneur, just doing my best to share my spiritual birth, spiritual, oh, whoa. Okay, the guys are saying, let's not waste any time. I have been pre-meditating while protecting my energy for the star sign of Leo. You're first tonight. Leo, I can already tell you, the minute I started meditating, overall, I've been meditating over the fire element for about 12 hours now. And there's a lot of aggression and conflict in all the fire signs overall. So I knew going into this read that I needed to take a fresh spiritual bath and protect my energy because there is a lot going on here. So your guides, Leo, are cutting right into this. I mean, this could even be some of my ancestors that are Leos. I don't know, but we're going to get into the read. By the power of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, please protect my energy as I divinate this message for the star sign of Leo. You can have Leo anywhere in your chart, sun, moon, rising, or north node more specifically, as well as the house it represents as in the fifth house, okay, which is represented by pleasure. Leo, take only what resonates, okay, and leave the rest. I could be picking up on energy around you, or I could be picking up on energy of someone who's dealing with a Leo. Now, off rip, Leo, you have a couple of signs in your energy right now. For some of you in the month of June, you are going to be dealing with a Scorpio. You're going to be dealing with a Sagittarius, or you're going to be dealing with an Aries. Take only what resonates. You can be dealing with any sign, but here's what I got. Something significant is going to happen for some of you in the month of June inside of a limousine. Now, I don't know if this is a conversation or some kind of act or something involving a limo for some of you. Whatever this is, it's going to be pivotal. Now, I don't know if this is like a premeditation a warning or whatever, but what came out with limo was use caution, okay? I don't know if this is going to be an argument, a conversation, or maybe it's a pleasant surprise, but I visualized sitting in a limousine, Leo. That's going to be for some of you. Now, let's talk about the other downloads I got before we get into flipping the cards. Leo, some of you in the month of June are going to be dealing with a mother archetype or a mom, your mom, someone else's mom, or a baby mama, something. They're in mommy dearest energy. This person is miserable and they want you to share in this miserable misery. Okay, I'm getting misery loves company. Somebody is unsatisfied with some dynamic of their life in the month of June and they're going to want you to partake in this energy with them. Spirit, again, is urging you to use caution in how you deal with this situation. Okay. There's also something significant about tea. Herbal teas, sweet tea, I don't know. Something about tea is significant. Perhaps you're trying new teas or you like to drink tea. I'm picking up on a Leo that is going to set aside tea time and make that a staple in their daily routine. Okay. Maybe this is slimming tea, Leo. I don't know. Something about tea. There's something else coming out in your energy regarding freezer spells and a false flag. I don't know if you're dealing with someone doing this to you, Leo, or you're actually doing this, or something in regards to something glitching, freezing, or coming to a full stop. This has something to do with someone either bearing false witness, flagging something illegally, or something being false here. You may be doubting some kind of love that is going to be received in the month of June. And this is because of who it's coming from. Be mindful. We are still in the shadow phase of the full moon energies. There was a sacrifice, Leo, that was made 
If you were involved, then you already know what I'm talking about. If you weren't involved, this was done unbeknownst to you. But your energy definitely was because it's coming out with the zodiac sign of Scorpio. There is a Scorpio in your energy, Leo, that is hiding behind lies. And these lies may have something to do with an esoteric group or affiliation. 33 may be significant. You're going to be coming into some kind of intel regarding rumors. And when you find out where the origin of these rumors are coming from, you're going to know immediately that these rumors were started to try to discredit some dynamic of what you got going on or what someone else has going on. I don't know why this involves you. In some way it does. All right, that's all the channel messages, Leo. Let's get into the tarot. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah, coming out in your own energy, we have the Queen of Wands, the Hidden God. Number four may be significant for you. Divine power guards against mental troubles. It's going to be important for you in the month of June, Leo, for you to protect your energy, okay? This can be done in many different ways. If you're not a huge spiritual person, protect your peace. If someone's trying to drag you into some drama, stay classy. Even though you know this person probably, you know, is trying to be facetious or trying to pick a fight, this person is thirsty for clout, okay? Okay. Take only what resonates with you. You also have the Five of Swords. Someone could be taking these actions towards you in the month of June, Leo, because they're jealous. Straight like that. This is falling out over this grid of subject cards here. Over starting rumors out of jealousy because I want your life. This person is jealous over your looks or some physical dynamic of your life. If it's not your physical beauty or handsomeness, it has something to do with your life or some dynamic of your life, okay? Can we get an energy on who this may be? This could be someone in your family. Now, the only family dynamic we had come up was mommy, okay? So this could be, some, a, again, a mothering archetype. This could be a baby mama, a physical mama, a stepmama, an in-law. I don't know who it is, but Leo, there is a mommy dearest in your energy that is unsatisfied with their life on some kind of level and they may be trying to drag you for lack of a better word in the month of june to make themselves feel better about a situation let's get something on this limo and why are we talking about limos here thank you holy spirit yeah i'm telling you whatever is going on in this limo is going to cause a tower moment now, not all towers are bad, Leo, but this tower may involve a Sagittarius, an air sign, more specifically an Aquarius. I don't know, but you got limo, okay? You have used caution, and you have Archangel Uriel, which represents the tower in the Angel Tarot, okay? Now, for some of you, this may not be something that is completely unscathable, right? Maybe you're going to have some kind of spiritual occurrence. I don't know if this is an accident or some kind of setup or an argument or something. It, you know, it may not necessarily be a bad tower, but somehow it has something to do with um, time, okay? You have the world card, you have temperance energy, earth angel energy, Maybe the limo is going to be late. Maybe you're worried about being late to somewhere in the month of June. Or there's some kind of argument that goes down or some kind of altercation that goes down in a limo. Something to do with a limo, okay? That's not going to be for everybody, obviously. Let's see. Let's get a Moonology card since we had Moon Energy come up. I pulled out a couple decks tonight because I wasn't sure what was going to happen. I need to make a sacrifice on the full moon with Scorpio. Okay. You have new moon in Libra. 
okay? So there may be a Libra that's significant. Maybe a Libra is involved in this uh, planned full moon activity. Let's just say that. A new romantic cycle begins. Leo, this could be love spells or this could be some kind of ritual. In this particular monology card, though, it's representing the scales here. But what I'm also seeing is the Ace of Swords in reverse for some reason. And we had hiding behind lies also come out. Someone could be saying that they're not involved in something that they actually are involved in. And this is involving a Scorpio. Now, I don't know if this is directly related to a Libra in a Scorpio, or this has something to do with Scorpio hiding some kind of connection to an esoteric ritual or group. Yeah. This person could have a water sign on their mind or something to do with intuition. Okay. New moon in Pisces. Meditate and contemplate to find out a deeper meaning to whatever that entails. Again, it's going to be general, so I don't exactly know. Take the pieces where it fits. If you know what I'm talking about, you do. If you don't, you don't. If you're dealing with an Aries Leo in the month of June, there's going to be a fiery climaxing approaching with Aries. Absolutely. And it's going to be hard to miss. Now... Let's talk about compatibility for a minute in the month of June, Leo. If you decide to spend some time with an Aries in the month of June or collaborate with an Aries or something regarding an Aries, it's going to be pop, pop, popping, okay? Energetically, you and Aries are extremely compatible. The passion is unmatched there, so... Again, I could be talking to a star sign that is Leo, or you may have Leo highly aspected in your chart. There's some dynamic of this that involves feelings. This person has deeper feelings than they reveal about you, but you're doubting this love in the month of June. Perhaps you're going to be exploring this to find out more, right? Because you may have an ideal vision of how you want this to go, but you don't really have any plans set in place. And that's going to be uh, the part of it in the month of June that you're going to have to work through. All right. Where is... Where are we at? 13? Messages for Leo. Messages for Leo. All right, we got... Mm. In whatever dynamic this is, you're ready to receive love in a situation. Ace of Cups. Self-love may be necessary in the month of June. Okay? Or you may be finding out after the shadow phase of this full moon energy, that whatever this sacrifice involved is going to backfire. And I don't know if you're going to like the way it backfires. It really just depends. Were you involved or were you not involved? All right. You're going to be watching something occur. Um, this may be either you deciding something or someone else deciding something. I don't know if you're going to be happy or not about this. You may be confused or you may feel like this is an illusion. You have the six of pentacles in reverse. So whatever this is, it's not going to be a balanced situation. You may be reviewing something also to see what went wrong. Okay. I don't know what that's about, Leo, but I'm going to tell you this right now. Whatever it is about for some of you. You may not be happy about it. You may be emotional about it. Hmm. Messages for Leo. Something about the Bahamas. You may feel like someone doesn't deserve something. Possibly 
intimacy. Mm. I don't know what this is about, Leo. Month of June. You may feel like someone in your life in the month of June, Leo, only wants you for your money. Now, you could be the energy opposite of Leo. Take whatever resonates with you. There is a passed on loved one that's trying to contact you. If you're not a Leo and you're cross-watching for a Leo, this ancestor may either be tied to this Leo energy you're cross-watching for or your passed on loved one is a Leo. So again, take only what resonates. There's something very significant about an event or something you're going to. And if you are ordering a limo or a driver on any kind of level, you need to use caution. All right, Leo, that's the messages I have for you for the month of June. And until next time.